from WNY News, this is First Morning Weather. Well, welcome back. It's a chilly, blustery night across the Twin Tiers with occasional snow showers. You can see some reduced visibility off the Cornell Sky Cam uh, late tonight. This will persist through the overnight period and for the morning commute for tomorrow. Accumulations in most valley locations will be easily under a half an inch. But I was taking a look at some of the DOT cams and some of the higher terrain, especially up over the Southern Finger Lakes area, and there are some snow covered roads out there. So uh, while we're not expecting a lot in the way of accumulation, there certainly could be a couple slippery spots out the door early tomorrow morning. So may want to plan on giving yourself a little bit of extra time. Uh, we had a high temperature today of 38 degrees and a low of 30. Typically this time of year, we're at 45 for a high and 25 for a low. Now moving forward, our weather headlines looking like this. The cold and breezy conditions will persist over the next several days. So even though we're officially into spring tomorrow, not going to feel that way until early next week. Uh, skies remaining mostly cloudy and we'll have occasional snow showers to contend with as well. So here's a look at our temperature trend over the next five days. 39 tomorrow. We do bump it up to 44 on Wednesday, so that's almost where we should be for this time of year. But then back down to the 30s Thursday and Friday near 40 to head uh, start off the weekend on Saturday. Now temperatures at this hour generally in the 20s and lower 30s, and we are expecting the temperatures to bottom out in the mid 20s overnight tonight. The snow showers are persisting. Uh, there's weak areas of low pressure moving in from the west, gaining some moisture as they cross over the Great Lakes. And again, some of these snow showers have been persistent and especially across the higher terrain. I was mentioning uh, some of the DOT cams. I was looking up towards the Prattsburg area here and in, uh, on some of the hilltops, we are looking at snow covered roadways. So uh, that could hold true across Schuyler County, Tompkins County as well, and even sections of Tioga and Chemung counties up across the higher terrain. Uh, it may be a little bit slippery out the door early tomorrow morning. Generally speaking, though, the accumulations will be less than an inch, but where we're seeing those snow covered roads right now up towards the Prattsburg area, this particular model showing the potential for an inch or so of accumulation. Now tomorrow's plan are showing perhaps a couple peaks of sunshine early on, but generally speaking, it's a mostly cloudy day. We'll throw in the chance for a couple flurries and snow showers yet again. Temperatures in the upper 30s, but feeling colder when you factor in the winds. So a couple snow showers tomorrow and again on Wednesday and Thursday, mostly cloudy skies. Friday, mostly cloudy as well. Now, windy conditions likely as we go through Wednesday afternoon. Some of the wind gusts could approach or exceed 30 miles an hour, and that'll hold true Wednesday night and into Thursday. Now, as we take a look at our long range guidance here, this will take us through Friday and Saturday. One of our long range computer models showing the potential for a storm brewing along the east coast. This is still a little bit up in the air as it's not expected to form until Friday or Saturday morning. But this particular model does take it up along the mid Atlantic coast and heading into Saturday morning could be some accumulating snow for us. Still well too way too early to to fine tune the details here, but something we'll be watching. There is the potential for some rain or snow heading into the start of the weekend. 40 is what we forecast today. We end up hitting 38 for a high snow showers around tonight with breezy conditions lows in the mid 20s up to 39 for our first day of spring tomorrow. Snow showers still possible 44 on Wednesday. We're dry Thursday and Friday, but again watching Saturday for the potential for some rain or snow.